That is water rescue pulling up. So, it's not so you guys didn't have any problems. No, the before, motors and everything were good. Before just, here, you yeah. you just started having trouble over here. Right here, yeah. mm -hmm. the waves back that way. Which direction? North. South. Yeah, you guys came from this way. Which way is that? South. Yeah. Okay, well, from the south, it wasn't bad. The waves weren't terrible, but when we got over here to the east, the waves uh, started getting heavier and heavier and heavier. Mm -hmm. That's when they started hitting the boat, mm -hmm. and the water started coming in more. Okay. And then we just hit one bad wave, and that's all it took, and there was enough water to put us underwater. All right, so we're told that these two divers are going to get into the water. They're going to hook up two air balloons. They're going to strap them around the boat. And then there's a air hose. They're going to air those balloons up, and that will pull that boat to the surface. And then they will be able to use a pump and pump the water out of the boat. Guys, guys, guys. You can see getting down to the lake was one of the hardest parts. Dalton and James had to guide these divers down down the bank. It was just huge unsteady rocks and it was probably a a good 15 feet down to the water edge. So James and and Dalton guide each diver down. And then you'll see that they have to also carry gear down to the water edge. Wow, you guys. Yeah. Same. I got your bag of chips over here too. So the straps are around the boat connected to the air balloons. Now he's going to put some air into the balloons and see if they can't get that boat to the surface. So they've got the straps all hooked up. The air balloons are blown up and the boat is 
not to the surface, so they are unable to pump the water out. So the conservation police are hooked up to that small boat, and they're going to try and tow that to the bank.